Hi my lovelies, I hope you're all well. So I thought I would share with you today how I've made my storage hoops for my pegboard. So, so is it true? So lots of you that have seen kind of sneak peeks of the pegboard uh, and saw my live on Facebook the other night kind of said, oh my goodness, what are those hoops and how do you make them? So these are just embroidery hoops and I've added some beautiful fabric and they make really good storage devices for your pegboard. So you'll need an embroidery hoop and you'll need two pieces of fabric. You want to get your embroidery hoop and you want to separate the outer and the center piece. We're going to take away the outer piece and we're just going to use the inner piece of the hoop. I'm then going to get my fabric and I'm going to cut around my hoop. I've been generous with my cutting but all this will be cut away so if you want to go closer with your cut you absolutely can. You want to do exactly the same for your second piece of fabric. So I'm still working with the inner hoop and I've got my first piece of fabric so I'm going to place that over it. I've then got my second piece of fabric and I'm just going to fold that in half. And I'm going to place it over my hoop and my other piece of fabric about halfway up. I can then get my outer hoop and I can just place that over. If we then turn our hoop over, we can just start pulling the fabric so it's nice and taut. You can then turn it back over, make sure you're happy with the placement of everything and you can then just start tightening that hoop. And as you tighten it you want to keep pulling that fabric. But I'm going to turn the hoop back over and we're just going to trim away that excess fabric. And there we go, we have got a beautiful, nice tool holder that you can use on your pegboard, or you can hang from your walls, uh, you could put it on uh, storage trolleys if you've got storage trolleys with little hooks. So there's so many things you can use these hoops with. Mm -hmm. 